My name is Faisal Isma and I'm a wildlife photographer, international safari guide and contributing supporter to Born Free USA. Over the years, I've had the incredible fortune to photograph some incredible wildlife in some of our planet's most remarkable wildernesses. And while every moment in the wild is special to me, it's the moments spent with certain individual beings that have left an indelible imprint on my soul because it was clear to me that those individual creatures were undoubtedly ambassadors for their species. While there have been many of these incredible beings, the moments I spent with the next few, I've certainly carried with me. First, there was the great Lion King of the Maasai Mara, known fondly to so many simply as Scar, whose story is as humbling as it is inspiring. He defied every odd as he ruled his kingdom well beyond what many believed was possible for a male lion. When Scar passed away, I wasn't filled with sadness, but rather a feeling of hope, knowing that he lived a life as a lion should, wild and free. Then, there was the time I spent with the great mother grizzly bear of the Grand Tetons, known to everyone simply as Bear 399. She too continues to defy every odd, raising cubs well into her twenties, something that's unheard of for a grizzly bear, proving to us once again how wildlife can thrive with the proper protections. And most recently, I had the great fortune of spending time with a leopard, simply known as Ravenscorn, who as an orphan cub proved nature's resilience against insurmountable odds as he grew up to become one of the most dominant leopards in the famous Sabi Sands wilderness of South Africa. I could tell countless stories about these incredible beings that share our planet with us, but the message would always be the same. It's that these amazing animals serve as our beacon and our lighthouse showing us that we are more connected to them than we can ever hope to understand. And beyond that, what can be accomplished if we simply allow nature to thrive? See, we must do all that we can to protect our planet's last wildernesses, if for no other reason than the fact that our planet's great wild beings deserve the right, as all living things do, to live free.